Hello everybody, this is Paul here from the Trachtenbergsystem.org and today I'm going to show you how to multiply any number by 7 using the Trachtenberg speed system of basic mathematics. Uh, this is part 4 of our 9 part series that we're doing on how to use the Trachtenberg system to multiply any number by any other number. Now if you haven't watched the previous tutorials I would recommend going through them in order because we're going to be covering a lot of tips and techniques and methods that we'll use in this tutorial and later tutorials that we've already uh, explained uh, in previous tutorials, so watching them in order will greatly help you. So the rule for multiplying any number by 7 uh, is to double the number plus half of its neighbour and to add 5 if the number is odd. Now I'll try and go through uh, a work example with you in this um, presentation, uh, but, but because there's quite a lot of different compounding rules that we have to do for each of the numbers, then my explanations might get a little bit confusing but I've written it all down for you anyway and I've got the calculations in the right hand side to uh, help you follow along. So the first thing that we're going to do is to uh, underline the multiplicand which is the number on the right and add a zero to the beginning of it to help us with the final calculation that we have to do. So starting with the first number which is 8 uh, we double that to get 16 and because 8 is um, even we don't have to add 5 and it doesn't have an have a neighbor. So we simply record uh, the result of eight times two, which is 16. So we record six and then add a dot above it to represent the carry 10. Now the next number is five, which is odd. Um, so first of all, we, we double it to get 10 and then we add half of its neighbor. Its neighbor is eight. So we do 10 plus half of eight, which is four equals 14. And then because five is odd, we add it onto 14 to get 19. And then we have to remember to add the carry 10 from the last result to get 20. So we record the zero and then add two dots above it to represent the two carry 10s. And then we move on to our next number, which is three. And again, three is odd. So we have another uh, rule to uh, add to it. And so we double the number first to get six. And then we add half of its neighbor. Its neighbor is five. So half of five is two. So six plus two is eight. And then because three is odd, we have to add five. So five plus eight equals 13. And then we add the two carried dots from our previous answer to get our answer 15. So we record the five and then add a dot above it to represent the carry 10. And then we move across to the next number, which is zero. And because zero doubled is still zero, we can effectively ignore that. And then we add half of its neighbor. So half of three is one. Um, so zero plus one is one. And then we add the carry 10 from the answer before to get two. And that's our final answer, 2,506. Um, Phil, I've just dropped, a, well, wrote down a couple for you here if you wanted to practice. So feel free to pause the video and I'll come back in a couple of seconds and show you the answers. Okay guys, here are the answers um, to the two sums that I gave you. Um, Hope you got them right. If you have any problems or questions, then please feel free to leave them in the comment section below and I'll try and help you the best I can. Um, and also don't forget to subscribe to our channel where you can see how to multiply all the numbers, high and low, um, together and the quickest and most effective ways of doing so. Um, and if you wanted more explanations and full instructions, you can go to our website, trachtenbergsystem.com. It's completely free, you don't have to sign up, there's nothing like that, just all of the instructions are written down in a logical order. Um, and also if you wanted your free PDF copy of the Complete Trachtenberg System, which is the book that you can buy from Amazon for 20 or $25, um, you can go to our website and download a free scan PDF copy of it, which is uh, available at trachtenbergsystem.org. And again, you don't have to sign up, um, you simply just download it and read and off you go. Okay guys, thanks for watching. Um, I hope you found this video useful. Um, if you've got any problems or questions or comments, then please leave them in the uh, comment section below and I will do my best to help you. Okay guys, thanks a lot and have a good day.